Rob sent me this, uh, his Dropbox, just filled with uh, texts and poems, Shun's poems, who, who wrote the script uh, with Robert, and uh, and uh, podcasts and music, and, uh, and of course, also lectures by this uh, lovely, very charismatic archaeologist, uh, English archaeologist, uh, Neil Price, who also wrote this amazing book called uh, Children of Ash and Elm that I also read. Uh, and that was that was uh, really great to 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 just like I mean, there's a lot that I don't really have that's not really useful for for my from 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 my perspective as like portraying this character, but but just like getting grounded in the material and just like diving into this world and learning about the the everyday life of these uh, of these people who, who lived in this time. I knew Alex a little bit from from from, from before. We, we have met a couple of times in in bars and restaurants and so on in Stockholm. Since he's also uh, Swedish, and but just like getting to work with him on this on this movie has been it, it's just been so great to watch him. He's such a great leading man, and he he always shows up with this with a this big smile on his face, and and he's setting this great vibe on set and. And working so hard. I mean, the the the, the physical, just the physical, the physical challenge of portraying the character that he does, must be uh, just overwhelmingly hard. And he does it with such grace and with, yeah, as I said, he always shows up with this huge smile. And yeah, he's he's a great leader. I I think, great guy. Nicole Kidman is she's royalty. She's she's like one of the biggest names in the industry, and rightfully so. She is just amazing. I don't know how many films I've seen with her, and she's always been one of my favorites. And just to be on the same call sheet as her is is sort of hard to wrap your head around. I think. Chris is just. Fantastic. He has this very, very intense presence and such a great charisma. And um, he's he's been so generous with me, and like, and we've really been able to like establish this father and son relationship and find what that is between these characters that's special for them. And and um, it's, it's it's been great. He's he's fantastic. I I love working with him. I'm proud to be his on screen son. Working with Robert is that's just been amazing. He's a true, true artist and a visionary, and he is. I think he's one of the most interesting directors working today, actually. And um, and he is uh, so incredibly kind and funny and humble. And he creates this space for me as an actor where I feel that I can just try things and fail and be bad. And and uh, and also he's. His, uh, he's very much an actor's director, and um, and um, he's also just a joy to be around. I mean, just the level of detail on the costumes and in the, in the all the environments and the sets is it's just it gives you so much in 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 terms of of uh, like piecing your performance together because it's especially in a time in a period piece like this, uh, it gives you so much just like just getting into the costume of, 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 of Thor and getting the rings on and the, and, and the hair and the beard and all it's, uh, and they're stepping onto set and you're actually like between action and cut, you're actually like living the life of these people, of these Vikings. It's, it's really, it's really a blessing to, to, uh, getting to do that. You haven't seen an epic revenge story until you've seen it through the eyes of Robert Eggers. That's um, uh, sort of what I would say to people. And I'm very thrilled for, for people to see this, this beautiful and violent and poetic painting that Robert is painting. It's, um, it's going to be, a, it's gonna be a, something that the world has never seen before, I think.